Yo, yo, what's up? It's your boy, Double, and today we're going to be talking about some fine literature. And the literature we're going to be talking about is Uncle Tom's Cabin. is a book published in 1852 by Harriet Elizabeth Beecher Stowe and is frequently referenced in many other literatures. She comes from the Beecher family, a Yale-educated clan from New England, Maine. I think Rockstar is giving a special shout out to her for helping pave the way and ending slavery with the help of her book. And slavery is a big theme here in Red Dead and her literature was used to um, use as stepping stones for uh, ending slavery, which was a hot topic for her time. and. And I'm actually surprised her, their work wasn't censored or anything. Probably in the South, but not the Union. And that's, I'm really proud of her for doing that. And I can see if Rockstar would name a region after her. Especially in a game that they make. You know, it kind of makes sense, you know, with American references. And she's an American hero. It might prove that Harriet has her name in the video game is because there's a property in West Elizabeth known as Beecher's Hope and her full name is Harriet Elissa with the E Lissa Beth Beecher Stowe so and the name it's West Elizabeth and there's a property named Beecher's Hope so in the name itself it says Elizabeth Beecher and that's about my evidence and I think Rockstar is naming this whole region after her because her idea was probably to push west and escape slavery in the east. Well, not escape slavery, but like run, like have the people push west and they can run away. And what really sparked my curiosity was this place called Old Tom's Blind, which I think is a reference to Old Tom's Cabin since it probably was a cabin before it was a blind. And it's up to us to really figure it out. And I don't know if we can do so, but that's my theory on why Rockstar named West Elizabeth after a famous author.